Hello right, guys, welcome back and today I just got a short tutorial on how to get transparent images because I know, well I don't know if you're going to need to use it if you're watching this video you probably do or you're just a loyal subscriber which is great um, but I found it quite useful with YouTube and uh, the little thing in the top corner of the, the video you'll see it in this video and all my videos uh, I like to have that transparent just to make it look better um, so yeah this is just a quick really easy way to do it uh, you can do it with Photoshop and all that I don't have that and to be honest I can't be bothered so I just got a really easy thing to do and it's called paint.net so first thing you're going to want to do is download it so you obviously want to go to uh, going to want to come to this download page which I'll link in the description um, so you'll just come straight into here, you want to click download then it'll start downloading like I'll cancel it because I've already got it downloaded so you're gonna wanna you're going, oh my god I keep saying gonna wanna I don't know why, you're going to want to um oh that's why you're going to want to run all the installation and everything and then how do, how do I get this off? run the installation, then you'll get this thing here which is paint.net so you're going to want to open it again not again for the first time and now you'll see it uh, should look something like this don't click this off just saying because that's what you need um, so first you want to get your image just grab it out of your windows explorer and drag it on and you're going to want to open it so you might have noticed this is my background um, but yeah, I didn't know what image to use, so I'll just use this. And basically, this is really simple to do. You're going to want to click on this magic wand. Like, I think it when you turn it on, it's normally on this, so just make sure it's on magic wand. It'll say magic wand if you hover over it like that. And basically, you want to select the white or whatever it is of your picture, and it'll select all that part of the picture. And you want to just hit delete. So now you'll see that comes up with this grey and white transparent background which means it's transparent so you can put that onto like uh, photo software onto internet pages all that sort of stuff so that's it really you can just oh last thing when you click save as whatever you want you want to make sure it's a gif or a gif or gif whatever it's called that thing or it won't work very well so do that it's really easy and pretty much that's it uh, if you have a more complex picture it should work as well um, this is just a really easy way to do it so if you enjoy this video if you found it useful please leave a like uh, subscribe if you can for more tutorials or gameplay or whatever it is you like that I do and thank you for watching adios